So what are the unique fluke features of low Z, auto V, and V check? Well, V check was introduced by Fluke to make it very simple to use your multimeter. All you do is you turn it on to V check and go to take your measurement and the meter does the rest for you. If we're measuring continuity, it's in continuity mode. If we need to measure DC volts, it automatically goes into DC volts and ranges for us. And if we need to measure AC volts, it automatically switches into AC volts and takes the measurements for us. And here we have 120 volts AC. I can jump back to measuring DC, and then we can do continuity. So VCheck is an automated way to make using your meter very easy and safe. In addition, this adds a feature that includes our auto, our low Z. What low Z is, is when I put the multimeter in low Z mode, now I have a very low input impedance, or about 3,000 ohms. Typically, when we're working with a multimeter and we're in any of the uh, normal functions, we have a 9.9 .9 or 10 mega ohm input resistance. This is a very low load, so it's meant not to overload any circuits, but if we have an open electrical cable, there could be an induced voltage of 30 or 40 volts on this, that that is too slow, too light a load to get rid of that ghost voltage. By putting the meter into auto Z mode, what we do now is we put a 3,000 ohm load on this, and this will load down the circuit enough to see if we have a ghost voltage that's just induced, or do we have a real voltage that we have to be concerned about. This is especially important if you're working with stray voltages in a utility. Having this low Z function on your multimeters is very important. In addition, meters that are not necessarily fully automated with V-check include an auto V mode. And what the auto V mode in low Z is, is if I'm looking at voltages, I hit a DC volt, it automatically switches into DC voltage mode, sets it to the proper range, and takes the reading. I can then very quickly switch over to an AC reading and have the same results and read AC volts. So auto V is a feature that automatically selects the voltage function and the voltage range. And VCheck combines the auto V and the low Z into simply turning your meter on, taking your measurement, and it does the rest of the work for you.